Hello. So now, on your mic, which chapter going on? Lines and angle. Hello. On your videos. Hello, Jitendra. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Which chapter going on? Circles. Lines and circles or lines and angles? Lines and angles. Okay. And we complete uh, prox uh, lecture three completed. Lecture three completed or not? Tell me last question. Prox, uh, we start your. This question is completed or not? This question completed. Hello. This question completed. This question completed or not? Tell me. This question yes, completed. Sir. Yes or no? Yes, sir. We have already already completed. Then we try this one. Okay. Today we start this this question. Are you remember or not? Sir. This question, today we start? Yes, sir. Okay. What is given in this figure? In figure, side QP and RQ of triangle PQR are produced two point S, according to question and T respectively. If angle ASPR is 135 and angle TQP is 110, find the angle PRQ. Sravan, yeah. this, yeah. yes, this question Yes, this question are completed or not? So I don't think so. This question is new questions, okay? Okay, if the, you remember this question or new or uh, previously we can solve? Yes. This question is new question? Yes, sir. Okay. Then what is given? What is given here? Angle ASPR is 135, right? And TQP is 110 two angles are given, then find PRQ. How to find PRQ, this end? Tell me, do you know by linear pair, we can easily find this angle? We can easily find this angle? Yes, sir. <coughs> 180 minus? 135. 135, it means? Six. 54, 45. 45. This angle is 45. And this angle we can easily find 180 minus 170 degrees, sir. 70 degrees. Then by angle some properties we can find easily uh, when we add 70 plus 45, then 
एंगल पी आर क्यू इक्वल टू वन एटी डिग्री देन एट देम जीरो प्लस फाइव फाइव सेवन प्लस फोर इलेवन वन हंड्रेड फिफ्टीन पी आर क्यू इक्वल टू वन एटी डिग्री देन एंगल पी आर क्यू वन एटी माइनस वन हंड्रेड फिफ्टीन टेल मी फिफ्टी फाइव डिग्री सर फिफ्टी फिफ्टी फाइव सिक्सटी फाइव सिक्सटी फाइव सर सिक्सटी फाइव ओके ओके वी सी यर इट्स सोल्यूशन नोट डाउन We have angle QPR plus SPR equal to one eighty degree. Then QPR one eighty minus one thirty five. We have already find here, right? Student, please on your mic. Yes, sir. Then now angle TQP. एंगल टी क्यू पी इक्वल टू वी कैन राइट टी क्यू पी वी कैन राइट क्यू पी आर क्यू पी आर बाई एक्सटीरियर एंगल नो नीड हियर यूज बाई एक्सटीरियर एंगल वन हंड्रेड टेन इक्वल टू फोर्टी फाइव प्लस आर फोर्टी फाइव प्लस आर बिकॉज Exterior angle is equal to the sum of two opposite angle, interior angles. So here, one hundred ten equal to forty five plus P R Q. Then we can easily find one hundred ten minus forty five sixty five. Both are correct solution. You can use this solution or that solution. Okay, note it. युक्ता यस सर एनी प्रॉब्लम नो सर ओके नोट डाउन एंड व्हेन यू कंप्लीटेड प्लीज इन्फॉर्म मी Completed, sir. Completed. Then, second question. What is given? Angle X equal to sixty-two degree, and angle X Y Z equal to fifty-four. If Y O and Z O are bisector of angle. X Y Z and angle X Z Y respectively of triangle X Y Z. Find angle O Z Y and angle Y O Z. Y O Z means this angle. Y O Z and O Z Y O Z Y means this angle. This angle you have to find. Then angle X and uh, tell me name of fifty uh, four angle. Fifty four angle means X Y Z. And Y O and Z O is angle bisector. It means bisect into two parts, right? Yes, sir. Then consider angle X Y Z by angle sum property by angle sum property by angle sum property the sum of three interior angles of a triangle is one eighty degree right then Y X Z is given sixty two. 
then x y z is also 54 then x z y means when we add 62 and 54 we got 62 minus minus 62 minus 54 it means 64 it is clear what is measurement of angle x y z uh, x z y tell me uh, 64 degrees 64 degree but according to question oz is angle bisector of angle bisector of angle x z y it means it means we can write angle x z o equal to angle o z y is half of angle x z y right it means we can write x z o equal to angle o z y equal to half of 64 tell me half of 64 32 32 32 degree then we can find and how to find O Z Y. Okay, O Z Y is 32. And uh, Y O Z. How to find Y O Z? Half of 54. Yes, half of 54 means we can write here uh, Y O is angle bisector. Angle bisector of angle x y z it means we can write here uh, x y o equal to o y z equal to half of angle x y z means half of 54 means Half of 54 means 2 to the 4, 27, right? 27 degree. Then by using angle sum property in angle O, Y, Z. And we can easily find angle Y, O, Z, right? Yes, sir. Is clear? Yes, sir. Yes. Here everything is noted then in triangle o y z the sum of three angle is 180 degree then y z o plus 27 plus 32 equal to 180 degree then y o z equal to 121 degree note down Ramesh went on your mic and discuss with me because online or offline also is not one way communication. So on your mic and discuss with me. If any problem, then tell me. Sampath. <coughs> Sampath. Okay, on Saturday, which chapters do you want to give a given test? Sir, lines and angles. And? And other? Sir, linear equations. Okay, beta. Any doubt in this question? No, sir. 
now. This work is completed. Yes, sir. All extent, please inform me. This solution is completed or not? Yes, sir. Okay. Then, hard questions from <coughs> exercise 6.3. What is given? Anyone, a student, please on your mic. Yukta, on your mic. Yukta, on yes. your mic and yes. read it. What in, is given? In figure, if A, B is parallel to B, E, and angle B, A, C equals to 35, and angle C, D equals to 53, find angle B, C, E. Okay. It means uh, when two lines are parallel and one line uh, is a transversal line, then some pair, some pairs are equal like pair of corresponding angle, pair of uh, alternate interior angle, pair of uh, alternate exterior angle. Do you know? Yes, sir. Do you know? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Yes. Then, first of all, only PAC is given, but uh, it is given AB parallel to AB parallel to uh, DE. Then we can write also this E angle is 35. We can write or not? Yes, sir. We can write. Sir. Then we Usually we can use uh, in a triangle D, C, E and by angle some properties we can write easily. Okay. This question is not very difficult. So see solutions here. D, C, E plus D, E, C is 180 degree by angle some properties. And we know that AB parallel to AE and A is transversal, then by alternate uh, interior angle, we can write uh, BAE equal to DEC or DEA. Both are same. So right here, right here, AB parallel to DE and transversal line, AE intersect them at A, and E respectively, then by alternate interior angle, by alternate interior angle, we can write DEA equal to PAE, right? Then both are 35 degree. Then in a triangle, in a triangle DEC, we have two angles, angle C, D, E and C, E, D. And we can easily find third angle by using angle sum properties. Okay. Then here minus 35, minus 53 and 180 minus, 180 minus, tell me. 180 minus, add them, 3 plus 58, 58, not 88, sorry, uh, 5 plus 3, 8, and 5 plus 3, 88. Sir, 88, 88. Then, D, C, E equal to 90. This question is not very difficult, but it contain in exam two marks, only two marks, solve it. Huh. Which chapter on your test? Uh, lines and angles and tell me. And uh, other chapter? Sir, 
लीनियर इक्वेशन ओके बट ओनली थ्री फोर फाइव थ्री फोर चिल्ड्रेन गिव एग्जाम दिस वर्क इज कंप्लीटेड This work is completed. Yes, sir. Can I move next question? Tell me, other student. Can I move? Okay, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And next question. <laughs> both are same okay remaining part remaining part no problem we have already find repeat question then this question tell me this question what is given sampath on your mic on your mic and read this question read this question what is given sampath are you present on your mic okay sarvan Yes, sir. Read this question. In figure, if lines P, Q, and R S intersect at point P, such that yeah. angle P R T equal forty degree, angle yeah. R P T equal to ninety five degree, yeah. and angle D S Q equal to seventy five degree, yeah. then find angle S Q T. S Q T S Q T means this angle. How to find? can be use uh, which line are parallel you know sir pq and r is parallel pq not pq uh pr but here not given so <laughs> we can use by angle some properties easily we can find Yes or no? Ninety-five yes, plus ninety-five. We can write uh, ninety-five plus forty plus angle PTR equal to one eighty degree, right? So add them five nine plus four thirty one thirty-five degree and angle R. Uh, sorry. Angle PTR. Yeah, angle PTR. Angle PTR equal to one eighty degree. Then we can easily find angle PTR equal to one eighty minus one thirty five. Means angle PTR means. Forty-five. Forty-five. If this one is forty-five, then this one also forty-five. Why vertically opposite angle? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Then also we can use in a triangle TQS. This this is uh, this uh, we can take angle PTR triangle PTR and again. We can write uh, P T R equal to angle S S T Q. Angle S T Q region vertically opposite angle. Then this one also equal to forty five. Then in triangle uh, 
uh, angle T S Q by angle sum property, forty five plus seventy five plus angle uh, S Q T S Q T equal to one eighty degree. Then S uh, sum of seventy five and forty five, five five ten seven four eleven and twelve. 120, right? 120. Then angle SQT equal to 180 minus 120. We can write 60 degree. It is clear? It is clear or not? Yes, sir. Yes. This question is very easy. Okay, see the solution. Here in triangle PRT, by angle sum property, sum of three angles is 180 degree and two angles are given. Then we can find out RTP equal to nine, uh, RTP equal to 45 degree. Here. Yeah. Then, HTQ and RTP is vertically a point angle. So both are 45 degree. Then angle TQS, we have two angles. And third angle we can easily find by using angle sum properties. Then SQT equal to 180 minus 120. 180 minus 120. It is. Note down. Note down. Completed. Completed, sir. Completed. Yes, sir. Can I move next question? Can I move next question? Yes, sir. Okay. In this question, what is given? In this question, what is given? Tell me. What is given? In given figure, PQ perpendicular to PS. It means PQ perpendicular to PS. It means angle Q P and S is 90 degree. It is clear. It is clear. Q, P, S is 90 degree. Tell me yes or no. Yes, sir. Yes. And angle SQR is given 28 degree and also given angle QRT is 65. Then find the value of X and Y. How I can get? Sir, X is 28 degree. X is 28, Y? Sir, opposite. Oh, vertically opposite. No, no. Vertically a point angle means this type. 
when two hmm. lines are intersect, then we can take vertically a point angle. This type figure, then this one equal to this one and that one. Okay. Sir, MC is okay. equal to 37 degrees. What? X is equal to 37 degrees. X equal to? No. First of all, we can take angle PQS and here 90 degree, then we can write X plus Y plus 90 equal to 180, then X plus Y equal to? No, but here Y is uh, which angle? SQ, SQR is 28. Okay, and 65 degree Q R R T and this one, tell me, this one, this angle, we can easily find 180 minus 65. 180 minus 65, tell me. 180 minus 65. So 150. Change. So Okay, then uh, 180 minus uh, 65, tell me. So 115. 150. Then this angle is 150. Okay, see the solution. PQ parallel to SR and QR be transversal, then PQR equal to QRT by alternate, by alternate interior angle. PQR, tell me, PQR. PQR is X plus 20, right? And QRT is 65, then 65 minus 28. The value of x is 37 degree. It is clear? Yes, sir. And how to get angle y? In a triangle, PQS. PQS by angle sum properties, angle SPQ plus x plus y equal to 180 degree and x is x is 37 then 90 plus 37 tell me 90 plus 37 90 plus 37 tell me 127 right and 180 minus 180 minus 27 127 we got 53 it is clear? Sir, clear. Okay, note down. Mm -hmm. It is not necessary to find this segment. No need. Note down. Only five students. 
When uh, when your uh, half yearly exam in next month? So September twenty first. Twenty first. September. Yes, Tell so me again. For me, it's, so so for September me, it's, so for me, it's September seventeen. Seventeen. All students. In my school also, half yearly exam uh, can be conducted second week, uh, week of September. Okay. Completed? Sir. Completed. Then, some extra question. Kendra, off your mic. Okay. Any dent on your mic? On your mic, like uh, uh. Kendra. Okay. What is given in this question? QT perpendicular. TR and TQR is 40 degree, right? Yes, sir. And SPR is also given 30 degree. Find the value of X and Y. Then QT is perpendicular to PR. It means make it here 90 degree. So, First of all, we write, uh, we can take triangle TQR. TQR by angle sum properties 90 plus 40 plus X equal to 180 degree. Then we can easily find the value of X. Right? And how I can get uh, the value of Y? We observe that Y is exterior angle, right? Angle Y is exterior angle of which triangle? Which triangle? Tell me. Sir, PQ, yes. No, no, no. In a triangle, PSR. Sir, PSR. Y is exterior angle. So, Y exterior angle equal to sum of opposite angles. Means angle 30 plus angle X. Then y equal to 30, the value of x is 50 degree. Then value of y is 80 degree. We can write easily, okay? We can write here region, exterior angle is the sum of opposite angle of a triangle. Exterior angle. is sum of opposite angle of triangle. Triangle, which triangle? PSR. It is clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Note down. Completed? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Completed.
ओके नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ई पी क्यू पैरल टू आर एस एंड एम एक्स क्यू इज वन थर्टी फाइव डिग्री दिस एंगल दिस एंगल देन टेल मी एनी आइडियाज Have you any ideas? Here we need to draw a line AB parallel to PQ. One extra line through the M, as shown in figure, AB parallel to PQ, and PQ parallel to RS. It means construction part is here. Okay. Then. When A B parallel to R S, then then Q angle Q S M plus angle X M B equal to one one eighty. Do you know by co interior angle? Do you know? Do you know by co interior angle? The sum of co interior angle is one eighty degree. So One thirty plus one thirty plus one thirty plus uh, angle X M B means we can write here one thirty plus angle X M B. It means <coughs> angle X M B equal to One eighty minus one thirty five, we got it. Angle X M B equal to forty five. It is clear. This angle is forty five degrees, right? Then same process. A B parallel to. A B parallel to. Here something is mistake. A B parallel to P Q. And next. Here B M Y equal to M Y R A B parallel to R S by alternate interior angle. So we can write B M Y is forty degree. So this one is also forty. It is clear. It is clear or not? Yes, sir. Then adding equation one and two. Adding equation one and two. X M B plus B M Y is X M Y, so X M Y is eighty five degrees. Note down. Note down. completed no sir okay note down Sir, 
then this is last question okay what is given op and oq bisect angle boc it is clear what is given op bisect angle boc and oq bisect angle aoc it is clear bisect means to divide in equal two parts we suppose here x and x and oq bisect angle aoc means we can suppose y and y it is clear then so that angle poq poq is 90 degree then very simple oa and ob are on the same line oa and ob are on the same line it means to make it straight angle means aoc plus cob is 180 degree by linear pair do you know by linear pair yes, means aoc is y plus y and cob is x plus x means when we take common two then y plus x equal to 90 degree and x plus y we can write x plus y we can write angle <coughs> poq it is clear yes, note down angle P O Q. This type question also ask in your exam. Completed. Okay. Then, how to solve this question? Two straight line PQ and RS intersect each other at O. Then angle POT, 75 degree, find the angle ABC. Do you know in complete angle is, the sum of complete angle is, 360, 360. 360. And uh, by straight angle, we can write 4B plus 2C equal to 180. A plus B plus 75 is also 180. We can use. Also 2C equal to 75. So, since OR and OS are in same line, OR and OS is same line, then make it straight angle. Means 2C ROP plus POT plus POS equal to 180 degree. These three angles, these three angles to make it 180 degree. It is clear. Means 4B plus 75 plus B equal to 180 degree. Then 4B plus 4B 5B plus 75 equal to 180 degree. Then 5B equal to 1. Then 5B equal to 180 minus 75. We got 105. Then 5B equal to 5B equal to 105 by 5. Then 21 degree. 
ओके वैल्यू ऑफ बी इज वैल्यू ऑफ बी इज ट्वेंटी वन डिग्री सिंस पी क्यू एंड आर एस इंटरसेक्ट एट ओ सो फोर बी इक्वल टू ए फोर बी इक्वल टू ए आर नॉट टेल मी फोर बी यस बाई वर्टिकली अपोजिट एंटर बाई वर्टिकली अपोजिट एंटर सो फोर बी इक्वल टू ए एंड बी इज ट्वेंटी वन देन बी कैन मल्टीप्लाई फोर इंटू ट्वेंटी वन मीन्स वैल्यू ऑफ ए इज एटी फोर इट इज क्लियर एंड ए प्लस टू सी इज वन एटी फर्स्ट यू नोट डाउन एंड अगेन बी राइट विच विच लाइन विच लाइन टू सी प्लस ए इक्वल टू वन एटी डिग्री राइट टू सी प्लस ए इज वन एटी डिग्री देन टू सी वैल्यू ऑफ ए इज एटी फोर देन टू सी इक्वल टू टेल मी वन एटी माइनस एटी फोर नाइंटी सिक्स नाइंटी सिक्स टू सी इक्वल टू नाइंटी सिक्स देन सी इक्वल टू नाइंटी सिक्स फाइव टू फोर जाए फोर्टी एट राइट वैल्यू ऑफ क्यू नोट डाउन दिस इज योर लास्ट क्वेश्चन ओके देन फाइनल लाइन्स एंड एंगल्स एंड लीनियर इक्वेशन कंप्लीटेड यस सर कंप्लीटेड ओके ओके योर क्लास इज ओवर ओके सर थैंक यू सर बाय